Number one cause of death in Texas is child sacrifice, abortion. And Pastor Jeffries is pro-life and has a good moral opinion, but he does nothing to help make it illegal in Texas. All he does is help to regulate it. When, where, and how you can murder babies. But does nothing to make it illegal. How you doing, sir? Did you get one of these yet? Yeah, I did. Okay. Actually, like, I want to be on the streets, but like, most of the people here will probably already be on your side. Why am I going to someplace else where like, most people wouldn't be on your side? Yeah, well, actually, they're not on our side because they're pro-lifers, right? Here? Yeah, they're pro-lifers. So what happens is the pro-life movement never works to make it illegal. All they do is work to regulate how, when, and where. So every law, every bill they've ever put forward only said when, how, and where you can kill babies or can't kill them, right? right. So like, let's go back to the, ab I'm an abolitionist, but let's go back to the abolitionists of black people, of slavery, right? right? Can you imagine churches, and this is what they did, this is what churches like this did, they, they worked to regulate how, when, and where you could have slaves, right. all right? That's what they did. Well, they should make it illegal, right? Abolitionists work to make it illegal. We don't regulate slavery. We don't regulate murder. So when a bill comes up, like HB 948, to actually make abortion illegal in Texas, this church up, did do nothing to help make it go through. Nothing. So what we're calling them to do is stop being regulationists, stop being pro-life, but actually be biblical and make it illegal. Abolish it. That's surprising.